Welcome to the Blossoming Classroom. I hear this question of how long do I use this tool that you're presenting before I know if I'm going to have success with the child? And I'll be honest, years ago when I was a teacher, I would get a new tool, I'd read about it, um, go to a seminar about it, I'd get really excited for it, I'd bring it into my classroom, I'd use it for two or three days, and like the first day, all the kids would really buy into it, and we were all really excited. And the second day, maybe half the kids would buy into it. And by the third day, I may only have a few kids using it. And I'd say, oh, it doesn't work, throw it out. Let me explain that when we get a new tool, it's really important that we as the teacher create consistency in using that tool for at least two weeks. And the reason why is that when we're creating a new habit, a new way of thinking, um, a new tool in the classroom, it can take up to 21 or 30 days for that to become a natural way of doing things. And so if we give up in the first two or three days, we've never created that consistency to know if we're going to actually change the behavior or change the environment of the classroom. So it's really important that as a teacher that we are consistent for at least 10 days with a new tool. That's the kind of point where we know like, you know what? We are getting some really good buy-in into this, so I'm going to continue using it. Or I've used it consistently for 10 days and nobody cares. At that point, you kind of know like that tool is not going to be effective in your classroom. So as you watch through these videos on this channel and you ask, you're asking yourself, how long do I use this for? When am I going to see a turnaround? I was wanting some magic and here I am a couple days into it and I'm not getting the magic I want. I want to encourage you to continue using the tool for another 10 days. Be consistent, be cheerful about it, and see if you can get that buy-in from your students. Thank you for watching my video today. If you've liked the content, please like below. If you would like to subscribe, that button's right here and you'll know when the new content comes out. If you have a question or a comment, again, comments are below, and I'll do my best to respond to you quickly. If you would like to do a deeper dive into the subject matter, please join me on my website listed below and I look forward to seeing you there. Thank you.